My father gave nearly three decades of his life to the coal companies, to Peabody, with the promise that his retirement would be secure. Now my parents are facing the reality and the fear that they may lose the ability to afford going to the doctor while CEOs like Greg Boyce continue to gamble with the lives of thousands of his employees and millions of innocent people. We have come here today as an act of resistance, as a showing of persistence, and to stand together in solidarity. known as the Diné, who have suffered the indignity of displacement and the cruelty of capitalism at the hands of Peabody Coal. We have come here to stand in solidarity with the people of Appalachia, whose water is poison and whose scenic mountain lifestyle is in danger of extinction. We have come here today to say no more! and they say, I have no place to go. This is my home. This is my life. This is where I was born. But, you know, this evil company only comes to destroy, to devastate, and to kill my people, dying every day, slowly suffocating from their respiratory diseases, slowly knowing they're drinking water contaminated, polluted with toxic pollutants, chemicals, that the company denies that it even exists because of We're fired up, we ain't taking no more. We're fired up, we ain't taking no more. We're fired up, we ain't taking no more. We're fired up. Hands up for your CEO. Corporate credit is to go. Hands up for your CEO. I'm here today as a St. Louisan to shout as loud and at the top of my lungs to, to send a message out as far as today's cold wind will carry my voice to say Peabody Coal, not in my backyard! Climate change deniers, not in my